Hey there YouTube, Mountain Boy here. A couple of the comments were pretty interesting. I thought about kit bags and I thought I'd show you my Hill People Gear runner's kit versus my Hill People Gear standard kit in the medium size. And a lot of the questions I get are about what's the best thing to kind of carry, conceal carry. And, and I always ask like, well, what's your use, right? If you're kind of a hiker and a backpacker or a bush pack crafter, that's where I think the the kit bag really kind of comes in. You know, it's uh, it's a little smaller uh, width wise. It's a little smaller height wise, but it's kind of a brick. It's technically, I think this is only meant to be two and a half inches, but this really comes in at like four inches. So it really protrudes from your chest. If you're kind of like me where you're a little thick in the middle, you know, I ride it up on my sternum. Uh, so as my wife puts it, it sits on my shelf. But if you're trying to wear like a jacket, you can't shut a parka in it. Uh, and I've had a lot of people who talk about like wearing a motorcycle jacket or a ski jacket. And for something like that, especially an activity where you don't want to wear a backpack where you have to sit back, that's where the runner's kit bag, I think it's a really kind of nice addition. I'll just show you that's that's it loaded. I put an airsoft pistol in here just for kind of demonstration purposes. Uh, that's in the Maxpedition holster in there. And, and this kit bag is a little bit bigger. I think they do, this is a regular size. I think it's 11 inches wide, seven and a half, eight inches high. So it's a little bit bigger. I have to admit, it does kind of go across your whole chest. And so if you're wearing with backpack straps, sometimes it'll kind of come into contact right there on either side but as you can see it's you know it's a lot simpler there's not all the pockets there's not all the organization there's just this kind of front administrative pocket there's two little flat pockets in there you know just enough for like a pocket knife uh, a light a little notebook pen you know a couple of keeper tabs uh it also kind of comes with you know it's the same chest harness arrangement Although what it also has is kind of a bungee cord that attaches here that goes around your waist that as you're running, it keeps it from kind of bouncing on your chest. I'll try to shoot some video here with it. I'll just put it under a jacket so you can kind of see what it looks like. But for those of you who are really just looking for more of just a concealed carry, something that's very high quality materials it's a little lighter it's not quite as abrasive as the regular kit bags uh these runner kits are kind of a nice addition also the other thing too i'll talk about is these zippers you really want beefy zippers because uh, if you're going to truly use this for concealed carry honestly you should train at least once a month with it and the way that you're kind of meant to access this is by essentially kind of tearing at the zipper. And I'll kind of demonstrate on the video, but the idea is they recommend you leave it open so you can hook your thumb in and then you can just tear it open. But it puts a lot of pressure on the zipper and that's why you want beefy zippers. So yeah, especially when you're looking at like the 511 or the Victas or, or other ones on the market, uh, I, I put a lot of weight into having a, a solid zipper because you should be assuming you're training with it at least once a month. If you're just using it for camping, stuff like that, or just for skiing, and you are going to be more gentle with it, then it's not that big of a deal. So I'll just put both bags here side by side uh, so you can kind of get an idea of the differences. You know, again, this is a, a full-size runner's kit. I do think they have a little bit of a smaller, but it's more like a snubby. I don't think they have an in-between. Uh, this is a medium Hill People Gears original kit bag. Different materials, same hardware. I have to admit, I like this material better. I think it looks cleaner. It's a little less tactical. Um, this is really nice. It's heavyweight, but it's also a little rough. And so if you have a light t-shirt on this can kind of feel it rub through i think this works a little bit better with kind of a runner style t-shirt it's not quite as rough so anyway hope that helps uh answer any questions and if you've got any more just put them in the comments i'm happy to answer them thank you